hello guys and welcome so in this video we are going to create profile update view and display view for our Django CRM application as you know we have extended our user model with one-to-one -one link here I have explained everything you can see my blog links in description so let's move to our CRM project now we are going to create profile so for using images in Django application we need to install pillow so pip install pillow p capital okay this will install pillow okay I have already installed my pillow so it is saying requirement already satisfied now we'll go to the code and we'll see the code so let's go to setting first settings.py and here you need to make sure that this line of code is there in your settings.py file after that in urls.py you need to have lines of code in your urls.py okay now let's add profile image in our profile model so use a profile app in that models so I have commented it I'll uncomment it and we are loading image field and here we are giving the default value and the default of the image which is stored in media folder and we are going to upload those images to users folder and this is null and block which means not required okay now let's save this one go to terminal and migrate python manage.py make migrations after that python manage.py migrate so now profile image field is created in our database now we have done with our model so now let's create our views I have already written the code for our profile view and profile update view so we, we are importing HTTP response module login required reverse lazy messages the forms which we have created user model and profile model and let's let's first see the forms so here we have created two forms user form and profile form okay so in user form we have important model form model form we are creating form for model so will be model will be user and these files we want in our form similarly these fields just now we have created the profile image also so profile image okay save this one now let's move to the views okay so in here it is the simple profile view template which we are loading which is template view and login required mix in which tells this view will be displayed if the user is logged in otherwise no displaying that view so let's first understand this profile update view so template view it is then we are loading the forms in user form and profile form in profile update view we have two methods post method and get method so here we are loading the post request dot post or none if the form is submitted then this variable will be request dot post otherwise it will be none now we have added image also so we need to add request dot files so we'll create a variable file data is equal to request dot files okay or none okay now 
the image field is in profile form so we'll add it here okay now in here user form that form data if it is request post and the instance the data which we want similarly instance and if the form is valid then we are going to save it and we are going to give success message and we are going to redirect it to profile otherwise the form data is here and it is be returned and this is the one so in get method if the method is get then this piece of code will not be running okay now let's see the template so in common template profile update so we have extended it using base.html loaded the crispy forms and here in the block content we have loaded the csrf token and this is important okay if you are not having this ink type this will not upload the images and the user form the name of the user form and profile form that's it in profile up in profile dot html similarly we are loading the extent static and if there are messages then display the alert box and here this one user dot first name user dot for last name this user is the user which is logged in if the user is not logged in then this will not be displayed okay and here note we are loading user and that user profile and profile image dot url we are giving dot url note dot now i have explained everything now let's run the server so python manage dot py run server and everything is working fine so let's out the browser so run refresh profile and we are loaded to profile and this image is the default one okay which is here in media folder okay now let's update we are going to change the email then we are going to change the number and we are going to change the profile image so now let's select this one and update so our profile has been updated the phone number has been changed and the user profile image also has been changed and the email also has been changed now let's see the media folder and in media folder user folder is being created and in that we are having this one now let's upload different one image we'll upload this one update the profile image has been updated but you can see two two images here what we want if this image is uploaded then this image should be deleted so to tackle that issue we need to add one library that library is django cleanup so we'll install it pip install django clean now we have installed the django cleanup so this will remove the issue so first we need to register it in settings.py it is the third party library so we'll add it here django underscore clean save let's run the server everything was working fine 
so now let's remove this one okay now we'll update we have successfully updated now let's see this the image has been deleted and our new image has been added thanks for watching if you like my video give a thumbs up comment below and motivate me and i will see you in the next video